folks, I'm uh, just going to show you how to set up a tracker Trident AS Bivy. Nice big long bag, fits in perfectly. Good grab handles, uh, nice cushioning pads and like a quite tough bottom for if you're fishing like where we are at Rake here today with a uh, loads of like gravel and stuff so you can just put it down and it not bother, it's not going to hurt your bivy. Simply unzip. All your bits and bobs inside, like your ground sheet, your um, then your pe then your like poles for your tension bar, and your uh, peg. They all have separate bags, so look, look how nice and compact that is. Got your, my pegs down here, all my tensioning bars, my uh, peak bar, my pivot, then just my opaque panel in here. Is my uh, ground sheet, so I'm just going to that away. Get your ground sheet out of your bag. Nice heavy duty bag, so just look after your ground sheet. Ground sheet's heavy duty anyway. And now, just unfold it all, throw it out. Right, then on your ground sheet, to find where your front door goes, there's a, an actual ammo sign at the front. So that's my front door there. Spin it around till I'm uh, happy with the positioning. You can see there? That that always means the front door. Then underneath, on your ground sheet, you have these pegging in points. So you're not always wondering where do I need to peg it in. Peg it in under them. Nice, heavily sewn into the ground sheet so they're not going to rip. So yeah, that, that's now you've got your ground sheet. Right, nice. If it's windy, I'd normally put two pegs in the back just to keep it down. But whereas it today it is windy, but it's windy on the lake, not around where we are. So get the busy out. Unravel it up. Open it up. With the Tracker Trident AS, um, it's an easy light bivy to put up because it's only got it's only got two brakes in the whole section. You've got one there and one there. Three ribs, straight up basically. So you just clip them together. That one there, that one's done. And with this bit, there's a tensioning cable that is already sewn into the ground sheet, so underneath are these little silver hooks. And on the bottom of here, you've got your little, little eyelet that you just hook it in like that, put it back over. Again on this side. This one gives you busy attention. See on the ground feet now. From both sides. Peg back. Nice. We've got, it's got these hard ends so your pegs don't stick through the end of your bag. Right. Easiest way to put this kind of bivy. Two pegs. In the back. So it's always perfectly aligned. Don't really need a mallet, but these pegs are going to like screw them in. Put your elastic bit on top. Right then. Two more pegs. Got these eyelets here. One on you. Because on the AES you've got your two. Different fronts, you've got your main infield and you've got your mozzie. So then, 
through like so. Up, started to rain, perfect. I'll do like so. And then literally pull over like that. Same again, just don't really need a mic, just screw them in. Clean that. This down's quite hard. There we go, that's one. And the pegging points again. That's two. Basically, the up. So now it's just time to go around and finish off the pegging. One. Unfortunately with my luck, it's just started just started raining so I have to quickly peg it all in. I've not finished my video off so I can show you on camera and chuck out all my gear inside. You can see through there I've got bed chair, everything, it's all soaking wet. Never mind. Right then, I'll finish it off. Now I'm going to put on the peak because this does, for this trident, uh, it does zip off. But I'm going to put it on now and then put the tension in back. Do, but that's where I'm again. Get a nice curved bar. Two ribs in it again, two bricks. And cross it into this sleeve. And through. Doing this in the brainstorm. It's not the most thing I think of when I think of having fun. Because I put it in one side, push it all the way through, clip it into these movable silver nail ends, and then get the tension in bars. Just also, like the rest of the track and stuff. That's it, so I'm back. Oops. Should be a little one for the peak. There we go. So when you move it up under a tree when it's raining, it's not the best idea because all you're gonna get all night is that. Right then. These this is the new bank sticks. The new quick sticks that they've brought out, they all lock into each other. This one's got the little needle on the bottom for put it in, so put that one in. Nice a lot of tension on the back. Now get these two. And these now run nicely. There we go. And this one. This one you want a low profile. Flat bit, ready to set up. Uh, on the Trident AS, you have uh, these little back doors which are vents so in the summer when it's really warm. Um, they're all velcroed and zipped, just like that. Vents to for air to blow through, so definitely worth the money. All tracker gears, high quality, Aquatex material, so as you can see, the water just bobbling off and running off like there. So, yeah, that's Tracker Trident AS. If you're a